It's time for a jean review. <laughs> PewDiePie is bae. Hey, we were talking all about Fashion Nova, and I have bought, <laughs> wait one second. I have this many jeans that I can't wear because <laughs> they're not my size. I have gone through so many jeans where I will try it out and they won't fit and then I'll have to buy the next size. And it's kind of annoying because with Fashion Nova, you can't get your money back and you have to pay to ship it back. You have to pay a stocking fee. So then when it comes down to it, you don't really get your money back. I end up selling my stuff on Depop. So if you want to check that out, my Depop is Vanessa is a wolf. It's such an internal struggle because I love their jeans but it's so hard to know what size is gonna fit you. And what I have found, ladies and gents, is that the materials that go into the pair of jeans really matter. I've never been somebody that looks at the fabrics and stuff that go into it. I didn't really know anything about polyester or uh, rayon. I knew nothing about what that really meant and what the percentages to cotton would mean. And it's really confusing. Today, I thought I would just break it down for you. Literally be like your gene scientist and tell you why it's going to fit a certain way because of what fabric's in it. Fashion Nova hooked me up with this whole box literally filled with jeans. <sighs> That is so heavy. So a lot of people have asked me like what my measurements are and I don't exactly know. I haven't even looked at it in a long time, but I'm pretty sure based on the sizing chart for Fashion Nova, I am a 2X. So I'm gonna be basing everything off of that. I will tell you if it's true to size, if it runs small, if it runs big, that kind of thing. And hopefully that gives you an idea of what your size would be. Let's just jump into it, guys. Let's just like go for it. For it, you know like let's jump into it <laughs> I'm so obnoxious I'm so sorry I mean tell us something that we don't know Vanessa we already know that you're fucking annoying and people still watch you for some reason the ones that I have on right now are the I got it from my mama jeans and I've seen this on everybody and I wasn't even sure if I wanted to get it because I was absolutely sure it would not fit me. These are almost 100% cotton, which is like a dead giveaway that it won't fit a plus size body. And if it does fit you, you have to at least go two sizes up. These are a 3X, so they do run small. I think that Fashion Nova really knows what it's doing when they make jeans because these are so good and I was not expecting that like they are perfect they look like they were made for my body it's nuts what I love about Fashion Nova is their high-waisted jeans because they are truly high-waisted I have some high-waisted jeans where they come to like right here and I'm like honey that's not high-waisted I've been wearing these all day doing errands and they're truly just perfect um, they do come cuffed and I just left them like that but I could roll them down if I wanted to I might end up picking these up in a 2x just because they do stretch out over the day and if I wanted like a tighter fit right here then I would be fine with that like I could go down to my true size do you see this do you see this Fashion Nova, you're really out here just making the booty look great, making the waist snatched, everything that I want. These are the classic high-waisted jeans. I do have a pair of these already in this deep wash because I bought it myself, but they were kind enough to send it to me. I think this is the most popular pair of jeans on their website. It is for a reason because these are a really comfortable pair of skinny jeans. I, I've worn a lot of skinny jeans in my life and you know like the stiff ones where you can't bend your legs eggs because they're so uncomfortable these are not like that and that is because they have more rayon than cotton in the fabric I find myself hiking these up a lot because they're 2x and these do run large because they have so much stretch in them so 
If you're a 2X, I would size down to a 1X because we don't, we don't want to be doing this dance all day. I was out with my sister at the grocery store and I was literally just like... <laughs> Hello? Oh, thank you. I'm back. I changed shirts because I got another Fashion Nova package. <laughs> Thank you again to Fashion Nova for sending me these things and like constantly giving me stuff even though I really like don't know why companies still want to like work with me. I don't get it but I appreciate it. <laughs> yeah this is a little crop top. It is a little bit longer so I tucked it in and it just says not your baby which is accurate because I'm not anybody's baby, and if I was in a relationship, I would not let somebody call me baby. <laughs> I just think it's weird. This gives you peach. This gives you peachy realness, and I'm for it. I forgot to mention, but I am 5'6", so these hit me right at my ankle. Because of how stretchy they are, I would consider them more of like a jegging and not really a jean. The previous pair were a lot thicker than these, and these are very soft to the touch. I wanted to try like a whole bunch of different styles, just so I have a variety for you guys to pick from, but uh, I can't really say it's my style. <laughs> if it was just like plain, no distressing, I think I would like these jeans more. These are the up to no good distressed jeans in dark denim. Here is what I have found, ladies and gents. If the ratio to cotton and rayon is like 50%, you will like the jeans. If there's any polyester in there, I do not want them. These are so comfortable and I can like, if I wanted to like karate chop, <laughs> I think I pulled something. I don't know if you can tell, but these are even more high-waisted than the other pairs. They said, oh, you want high-waisted? We'll go up to your bra. Bra ends here and my jeans start here. I don't know about this ratio. <laughs> like, add a few more inches and you have a jumpsuit, my friend. So my rule of thumb is to get the next size up if it has these big rips in them because I'm already coming out of these as it is like little sausage-ness going on so these are 3x thick thighs might save lives but they also get strangled in ripped jeans <laughs> it's just not a good combo the rip goes all the way to here and that's gonna give me chafing in places I don't want. I also feel like there's a little bit too much fabric right here and I don't know what to do with that. Like where do I put that honey? I don't have any I don't have any package to secure all of this extra fabric with. I'm not trying to make it look like I got some something going on you know? And these are perfect ankle length for me Here's what the back looks like. It does have a gapping situation, but it does form to my figure enough where it isn't too bad. The next pair I have on are the glistening jeans, and I wasn't sure if I was gonna like these just because they are this tinsel material and it makes it super stretchy. I had to ask them because I got a 2X before and they did not fit. Honey, they barely went up my thighs and because they have all these rips in it, I was like, I'm gonna look like a sausage if I try to put on this pair. These are definitely a more fitted pair of jeans and the waistband is much smaller than other pairs of jeans that I've tried. They have the same problem of being a little bit gaping in the back. Maybe that's just the way that they're made is just a little bit tighter around the front compared to the back. The weird thing about these is that they feel like jeggings, but they're more of like a thicker material, so they feel more sturdy. If you understand what I'm saying, I don't even understand what I'm saying. I need a drink. <laughs> I did see my girl, Javi, wearing these jeans, and it made me want to get them, even though they have this giant hole right here of just like, thigh. Ow, that kind of hurt. <laughs> 
here's what they look like. I really do think they are a good fit on my body. I just really don't like the gapping part right here. How does the booty look? You guys tell me. I'm not really sure. So these are the Carry Me Away High Rise, High Rise, High Rise jeans in light blue wash. I was kind of interested in this button detail. I'm sure when I'm trying to go to the bathroom and I have to unbutton all of these, I'm not gonna like it as much. Just a little bit of like vagina jean situation going on and I can't say I'm into that. They make 2% spandex work for your body. It cups the booty. Whatever kind of fit they use, I appreciate it. I guess I'm just changing my top like three times in this video. Don't know why, but I'm, I'm not mad at it. This is from Fashion Nova. How adorable is this? It's like a mesh. And then it just has these little angels all over it. I'll link it down below with everything else. Anyways, the jeans. These are the Sophie High Waisted Jegging. They do have rayon in it and spandex, so I knew they were going to be super stretchy. So these are a 1X. I would say size down if it says jegging, because that means it's going to be like real stretchy. These pants just feel like a nice hug if that makes sense. Like, they're just bringing you in. They're like, come, come to me. Let me just form to every curve of your body so nicely. Plus they have that lighter wash, which kind of highlights the butt. They are similar to the classic high-waisted jeans. The only difference is these are even thinner of material and they don't go up as high-waisted. They've truly made these jeans to really fit like a 5'5 five, five to 5'6 five, person. I just really like these jeans. These are definitely in my top five for sure. Editing Vanessa coming in to tell you that after that last clip, I got a horrible migraine and the next footage is going to be from the next day. All right, this pair is way too big on me and this is crooked. Based on the fabric, I thought these were going to be so small and not stretchy. I got a 3X and I should have gotten a 1. It has 15% polyester and 10% rayon. And if the rayon is less than the polyester, usually that means it's not going to stretch very well. Anyways, this is the drink till he's cute high-rise jeans. I swear to God, Fashion Nova has the most fun coming up with names of products. Like, drink till he's cute. That's hilarious. I do like these because of the patchwork. I think they're interesting, but I hate the cut. These weird capri length pants are in fashion right now and I don't understand because they're so unflattering. I'm part of Team Kankle, so this is just not flattering. Yeah, do you guys just see how much extra room I have in here? It's like I could, I could be like three months pregnant in these jeans and it would still be comfortable. I really wish these fit because I really like the patchwork. It's more of like a jegging material than like a true jean. I can't really get into this because of the wash of them. It kind of look, looks like a, how do I say this nicely? Uh, cum stains. Like you're making a statement with these jeans, but I don't really know what it is. Like, did you just fuck up your jeans in the wash or what are you doing? When I look at these jeans, I just think it's the first time that they ever tried to do a load of laundry and they somehow put in jeans with something metal and it just like tore up the jeans in random spots. These are go on your own way skinny jeans. I mean, you really are going your own way, living your very interesting life with these pairs of jeans. It's very comfortable because it has 60% cotton and 38% rayon, 2% spandex. So it's gonna be that comfy fit that I've been kind of talking about. And I do like the fit of these. They are very high-waisted. They're comfortable. I believe these are, yeah, these are a 1X. So as you can see, depending on the fabric, I range from a 1 to a 3X. So it really does matter what fabric is in the materials. 
what fabric is in the materials? What fabric is in the jeans? I like the placement of this distressing compared to the other jeans that I've tried. It kind of looks like you did this. Like, it could be a DIY, but also you could have bought it like this. You know what? These are some garbage. These are some straight up garbage. And there's a reason why they're only $20, because they suck. I'm like getting so upset. <laughs> but based on the fabric, it's 80% cotton, 15% polyester. That is a warning sign. Go back, choose a different pair of jeans. And only 5% spandex. This combination, this combination of fabric is actually torture and should be used in medieval times. And if somebody did something bad, you should make them wear these jeans. I love how it even says plus size runs one size small. How about like two sizes small? How about like um, if I had a 5X, sure, this would fit. But a 3X, I can barely even button it. I'm like actually in pain. I'm not even trying to be dramatic. This is nonsense. It's a 3X and it's cutting off circulation. Like I feel, I feel like my stomach is just ready to pop out. Like this button is holding on for dear life. This, where you can't even bend your legs, this is fucked up. Why do jeans like this exist? One of those pairs of jeans where you would come home and you would just wanna go like, this because your stomach has been suffocating all day and it actually hates you. We are almost done, y'all. We've come to the last pair of jeans. These are the perfectly classic jeans. They're made out of that same tinsel material, so they're a jegging. And I wanted to try them in like a olive color because I was like, okay. Like, what other colors of jeans do they have? I like them. I think that they are very thin. So I think they'll just give you that belly line if you're not, you know, super flat, which I'm not. <laughs> and I don't know many plus size people that are flat right here. Would I buy these myself? They're $40. They're not exactly cheap. Um, I guess compared to some other jeans for like $100, they're cheap, but I don't know if I would buy them myself. They are a 3X, so I'd recommend going a size up because they run small. I haven't worn these all day, so I don't know if they stretch out. I have thought about doing a wearing Fashion Nova jeans for a week and telling you guys, like, do they stretch out? Are they comfortable all day? That kind of thing. So if you're interested in that, let me know. They do enhance the booty. They, they know what they're doing when it comes to the pocket placement, like a little bit higher, and then it gets the under booty looking snatched. I can't say there's anything inherently wrong with them other than the fact that they're a jegging, so they're a thinner fabric. They're gonna emphasize things, so if you have things that you kind of need smoothing out, you may not like these. I guess if you need a good pair of olive jeans, these aren't a bad option but it kind of depends if you want a pair of jeggings versus a pair of actual jeans. I wish you guys had like touch-a-vision where you guys could feel how soft and silky these are. And they make the booty look good. So, you know, I'm not mad at them. I get so many questions asking like what size did you buy and is it true to size and all that kind of stuff so I hope this was helpful and that you guys learn to look at the fabrics because that's what I've learned. I definitely did not have this much knowledge on what fabrics work for me personally and now I do and it's really great. I'm probably gonna implement this when I buy other pairs of jeans now. Thank you Fashion Nova for sending these to me. I have two things I want to say though. You guys at Fashion Nova, if you're watching this, work on restocking plus sizes. Every time that I go on the website, all of the plus size is sold out and all of the straight sizes are still there. If that's consistently happening, I don't know why they aren't just getting more stock of plus sizes. It doesn't really make sense to me. 
The other thing is, I never get notified by an email if something is back in stock. I've tried different emails and none of it has ever worked. Let me know in a comment if you guys have had the same issue because it's really frustrating and I'm kind of over it. <laughs> Anyways, I love you guys so much and until next time, bye!